Through a partnership with Lenovo and the grant they gave us, we were able to translate our research into practice. We know for sure that data is power, but when you think about HBCU students getting access to that data, we think about minority business owners getting access to that data, and even HBCU professors getting access to tools to help them teach that data, that's where the inequality is. There is so much talent amongst our HBCU students and professors, but also amongst our minority business owners as well. And the Data Trade Gateway Program allows us to accentuate that talent. And we were able to create a data visualization tool that we then used with small business owners, students, and professors. So Data Trade Gateway Program allows us to give them tools and a specific software that evens out the plane to really allow them to dig into the data and get that power. And a unique feature of this project was we were able to provide this data visualization tool for free thanks to Lenovo. I got started with my jewelry business back in 2008 and I decided I needed to make a little extra income so I started making my own earrings, feather earrings, and it just took off from there. So I started focusing on the type of jewelry that I don't see as a black woman in stores. Jewelry that is uh, catered more toward our culture. Being an HBCU student, it was a great opportunity for me to work with business owners in the community. Being at an HBCU, we're always about cooperative economics and making sure that, you know, everybody leads a helping hand. So with me being able to use my computer skills and the things that I'm learning in the classroom to help someone in the local community, it's kind of what it's all about. Rachel Stewart, I love her jewelry. She has a really nice jewelry company, so being able to kind of help her with figuring out when's the best time for her to promote certain pieces and certain items, like it was really eye-opening to see how data can truly like help a business grow and make things better, so. Uh, she let me know where I was slack. <laughs> <laughs> In the way I organized my, uh, my labeling and the, the way I looked at my analytics, she, she showed me where not only how can the program help me, but how can I help the program help me better. So it was very refreshing to me. So she taught me a lot. Being able to actually look at the data and see how well she was doing in a certain seat versus another and like kind of ways to kind of help spread the pot, that was cool. Um, Bright Black is a Durham-based company that uses scent as an artistic medium to tell stories about blackness. Very well aware of the importance of metrics and analytics, but as a small business owner, you often don't have the time to devote to leveraging the power of analytics, and so participating in the program was a great opportunity. As an HBCU student uh, participating in this program, it's been really great. Uh, allows me to be able to explore kind of what I'm interested in and uh, allow me to work, I have um, real experience working with business owners. Working with uh, Bright Black Candle, it was honestly really great. Um, in my opinion, I like being able to be more hands-on. That's how I learn more. When I first saw the data uh, that she uh, sent me, it was really kind of um, intimidating at first. But eventually, after like uh, maybe like day or two, I was able to go through the data, be able to format it right to where it fits in with the forecasting. I think Hector's analysis was largely confirmatory. Kind of our high and low periods of the year emerged from the data. I thought it would be a really great opportunity for students to work with real entrepreneurs um, in the real world. The way this impacted me allowed me to, like I said, uh, mentioned earlier, like, allowed me to explore what I'm interested in. And as a way of doing that, allows me to actually be able to actually learn more about how uh, data analysis works and uh, how to specifically be able to do forecasting and using a sales map. I've been the developer of the Shiny Web app. 
data visualization app that have been presented by uh, Dr. Matthews and Dr. Rothenberg to HBCU faculty and students as well as business owners. Uh, we all talked about data visualization and data in general that became mega trend over the last couple of years. I believe that this program has uh, importance from different perspectives. Uh, one of them is the knowledge sharing. So there was a very tremendous amount of knowledge sharing between uh, us presenters as well as uh, participants. So whether they've been faculty, students or business owners, we all learn something from them and they learn something from us. So that is very valuable. We are in the midst of trying to upgrade our curriculum to have a more data analytics focus. So the Data Trade Gateway program could not have come at a better time. They were able to really have practice in the classroom, outside of the classroom with the software to come to become more familiar with it. It allowed me the opportunity to get my hands dirty um, in a safe way with a product that was really shelf ready and that could offer students a very rich experience. Um, as faculty members, we're always trying to introduce our students to different software tools um, to increase their analytical skills, and the R software was really great for them. It really helped them increase in their data analysis and um, their data analytics. We really are able now to go full circle. We're able to take now what we've learned in practice from our small business owners, students, and professors, and take it back to our research and create a next generation of the tool that's going to be better. And so being a part of this program has been very impactful because we've seen all of the knowledge that has been shared amongst the business owners, the actual students, being able to get hands-on training, understanding data by working with those business owners. We hope this partnership with Lenovo will continue so that we can provide this opportunity to even more HBCU students and professors who in turn can help small business owners analyze their data and be more successful. So we really enjoyed being a part of Data Trade Gateway program, partnering with Lenovo, and we look forward to what can occur in the future.